and the University of Minnesota Twin Cities. He's currently undecided on his major, but plans to study something in the STEM field. Congratulations, Joe. And now on to the Greater Denfeld Foundation Scholarships. The primary criterion for the Greater Denfeld Foundation Scholarships is that the students exemplify a true Denfeld spirit. The 1949 Denfeld Yearbook describes the Denfeld spirit as follows. The person with the Denfeld spirit does everything they can to improve the standing and build up the good name of the school. They avoid behavior wherever they are, which will harm or bring discredit or criticism to the Denfeld name. It is with pleasure that I present four Greater Denfeld Scholarships to recipients who certainly fit this description. Their collective contributions to our school and community have left a positive and permanent mark, and we are the better for it. This year's Greater Denfeld Scholarship recipients are Claire Barless, Joseph McCormick, Phoenix Ocean, and Keegan Chasty, who's on air. Forward. Claire will attend Bates College, where she will continue her soccer career while majoring in mathematics or engineering. Joseph has not yet decided on a major or which college he will attend, but I love the world of possibilities that undecided means for him. I hope you try lots of new things and land on one that combines success with your past, uh, passion and dedication. And Phoenix will be attending the University of Minnesota Twin Cities to major in English. Phoenix is a multi-talented young woman. You may have heard about her earlier this year when she achieved a perfect score on her ACT. And Keegan, as mentioned, plans to earn a degree in international business from George Washington University. Congratulations and thank you for everything you've done today. They are amazing individuals and shining examples of the Denfeld spirit. Finally, another new scholarship we have at Denfeld is the Thomas R. Wheeler Continuing Education Scholarship. Mr. Wheeler's children wanted to honor their dad's dedication to education and hard work, and have wanted us to choose a Denfeld student who has shown tremendous perseverance and resilience throughout their high school career. The Thomas R. Wheeler Continuing Education Scholarship in the amount of $1,250 renewable by each successful semester goes to Gabriela Lopez. Gabriela is considering, considering cosmetology at WITC. Congratulations, Gabby. Your hard work did not go unnoticed. Joanna Sacchetti. Ms. Sacchetti will be recognizing the Saltwick and Howe Scholarship winners. As you may be aware, Denfeld has been blessed with very loyal alumni and faculty who have remembered their school with very generous scholarship endowments to enable students to continue their education beyond high school. We have several very generous scholarship funds that are solely for Denfeld students. It is now my pleasure to recognize students who have been awarded scholarships from two of those funds, the Saltwick and the Haugie Scholarships. First, I would like to recognize our Saltwick Scholars. Marie Saltwick was a native of Duluth and earned her teaching degree at Carleton College. She returned to Duluth to teach at Denfeld for over 40 years. Her legacy to Denfeld was in the amount of $2.7 million. Would the Saltwick scholars please join me on stage when I call your name? Dalen Arsenault. Riley Clark. Riley Curtis. 
Xavier Decker, Gien Enriquez, Ren Jarvis, Jordan Kovac, Grace Crump, Sydney Larson, Brooke McIver, Joseph McCormick, Abigail Roberts, Jacob Snyder, Ariana St. Germain, and Marissa Whitkey. Congratulations to each of you. The $3,000 Saltwick scholarships are renewable for up to four years. You may return to your seats. Next, I would like to recognize the Hauke Scholars. Herman Hauke was a 1946 graduate of Denville. He worked as an auto mechanic most of his working career. Mr. Hauke valued education and left Denville a total of $3.2 million upon his death. Would the Hauke Scholars please join me on stage when I call your name? Claire Barless. Natalie Bohan, Elisa Bowles, Jacob Borham, Keegan Chasty, Christine Erickson, Isaac Fink, Joseph Francisco, Lillian Glass, Leah Halverson, Madison Hinderman, Austin Hindemian, Lindsay Johnson, Mary E. Johnson, Kylie LeMay, Noah McGrew, Phoenix Ocean, Elena Panfill, Tawny Plenty Horse, Joseph Rudd, Cora Samuelson, Cade Shea, Samantha Snyder, Joseph Budd, Kofi Wing. Congratulations to each of you. The $3,000 Hauke Scholarship are also renewable for up to four years. The Saltwick and Hauke Scholarships combined represent almost $500,000 in scholarship funds for the class of 2021. Could we please have a round of applause for these students? <laughs> Now I'd like to welcome back Principal Tom Tuscan.
After hearing about the astounding number of scholarships the class of 2021 has received, I'm sure that you're wondering exactly what the combined monetary value works out to be. Well, let me share the good news. Up to this point, the scholarship funds offered to the class of 2021 amounts to over $4.1 million. Yes, I said $4.1 million. Yes, I think you did wrong. I think you'll agree our students have done very well for themselves. Outstanding job, class of 2021. Give yourselves another round of applause. You, along with your parents, guardians, extended family and community, have much to be proud of. You've watched students receive huge amounts of scholarships thus far, but there are many more which will be shown in a slide presentation. At this time, I would like to invite the honors court to exit the stage and take their place in the audience so they can enjoy the slideshow as well. <laughs> 